radio in full effect. Up front, up front, let's go. My name is Habat Seguja, the stand up comedian. Known for doing the impressions of the Ugandan president, you're welcome, Utam Seven. And uh, I also act as teacher Mpamere. Salute again. This one you should break this. So, let me come again. I started uh, doing stand up in 2001 uh, when I studied with the character of the president. But then, with time, I elevated my, I, I advanced my career in comedy and I uh, uh, unveiled another brand as teacher and well, well, Can you bring that? Seriously? A student? A student? You moved with a phone. You moved with a phone. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a brand new phone. So you escaped and bought a phone. With stand-up comedy, uh, especially things concerning imitation, doing impersonation, you impersonate the person you like. Like his humor, he has got a sense of humor that is very unique from other presidents in Africa. I like his mannerisms, uh, use of proverbs, and other things. I just, I just like the humorous part of him. But I can confirm that His Excellency, the president of Uganda, Yoel Kagutam Seven, is my number one fan. He loves what I do. Uh, if it was another president, maybe you never know. Things concerning a political satire, he would have been in jail. But he's proud of me. That's why I like it. I started performing on weddings. Then from weddings, I went to the theater. Then from theater, I elevated my game uh, to television, uh, to TV stations. Then from there, I started getting different gigs, corporate gigs. So at that time, my game kept on elevating, uh, ele being elevated to another level, just like that. Until comedy has a future in Uganda. Comedians are taking comedy to another level. Uh, we have good comedy groups. They perform weekly. And uh, 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 we have uh, brilliant, young, talented comedians coming up. So comedy is the next thing, is the next export in Uganda in 10 years to come. Now that we have different exports, we have uh, uh, Kansime Ann, she's doing really fine. We have Patrick Salvador, a man from Ombokolo, and the teacher Mpamere, of course, Alex Mohanja, and other exports. Really, comedy is something that is going to compete with music, and uh, possibly at the end of it all, it will be number one. With enough professionalism, with more and more professionalism, uh, putting the comedy, uh, comedy craft, I see a number of comedians becoming professional in what they're doing, and they're going to do global tours. Uh, already we have started uh, uh, experiencing one-man shows, uh, one-man one stand-up comedy shows in Uganda. For example, Salvad is organizing a one-man show at Serena Hotel Kampala. So in 10 years, I'm going, uh, we're going to have more and more and more Salvados. But as long as comedy becomes a profession, not a hobby, then there is future in stand-up comedy. Don't impermire me! Don't impermire me! This is a radio! You had a phone? It has a radio? First of all, you have broken the rules and regulations of the school. Number one, carrying a phone. Carrying a for what? Carrying a phone. Number two, carrying a smartphone. Number three, your phone is full, or the battery is full, which means that you have tampered with the electricity of the school. Of the school. Number four, installing a radio on your phone. How many teachers have you seen? Can, do you know my phone? Do you see my phone? Does it look like yours? So, you are undermining the school code of conduct by carrying this. Have you seen me putting this here? Where does it, where does it go? It doesn't fit in. It doesn't fit in, don't you see? Now, go to class as I collect your evidence. Hello? First come. Where is the prayer button? I want to pray the next song. I believe the last king of Rwachtura coming soon, like the last king of Scotland, you never know. Some people might be there waiting for a movie, and I'll turn up for the auditions. Radio <laughs> full effect. Up front, up front, let's go!